Hello and welcome to the Lego Deadpool and Wolverine uh, bootleg figure review. Um, today we can start with Lady Deadpool here and this one feels so much nicer than the previous one but the previous one does have an unmasked face so yeah she comes with katana pack and they're painted but it uses the generic Ninjago pack whereas the other figures actually have a proper um, molded shape that looks like the Deadpool pack so the best of both worlds is you take these katanas and get the backpack from the other figures to make it look good so there she is with the big long hair thing and she's printed 360 degrees and these are the same ones using many figures and the silencer bits do pop off she also comes with a really small mm, it's not really a micro fake but baby of the size baby fake head does rotate uh, so we got a baby pool it's not kid pool it's even younger than that Speaking of Kid Bull, we have another rendition in, but he comes with the golden pistols and a transparent one, so you can give these to uh, Deadpool if you want. But he's also got these tiny golden pistols printed on the side of his legs. Um, belt logo is printed fully on here, as the other one cuts off a little bit, but this one also cuts off if you, you move, move the legs. So it feels like this belt should be better printed on the actual leg hip area. And he's got the short legs, so he's actually like kid size. If you remove the mask, you also have a Kid Pool mask on leave, but I think this bulky one actually suits Kid Pool more. My white here is slightly printed off centered, annoying. Comes with a backpack, got stud there, stud there and a handle so you can attach different things to it. Comes with dog pool, got the tongue sticking out. Um, no articulation on this, this is a single molded piece, but it's painted quite well. And also comes with head pool. Next up we have Cassandra and uh, her figure is a little bit off because they used a white torso for her which makes sense for the shirt area but this jacket piece is one of those hard plastic pieces that can only be put on or come off when you remove the head and the arms and the white is showing through. Now she, she does have some extra printing underneath this jacket so yeah you remove, remove a lot to see anything on the back. Pretty slightly off center, but yeah, you're not gonna see that, but still it's there and it feels wasted. I might I think I would have preferred if she was just a regular minifigure with all the details and jacket and stuff just printed on her. I'm not a fan of these big jacket pieces because A, they're very bulky, B, um they're a pain to attach and detach, and C, they show off too much of the uh torso underneath. So if you have different colored plastic and printing, well yeah, it shows up. She uh, it is nice that she comes with two different heads with different expressions. That's cool, I guess. She also comes with a fire ring to simulate the uh, Doctor Strange sort of teleportation ring thing, which is cool. Next up, we have one of these uh, uh, time soldiers. And this one is, we've had them before from different bootleg brands, but this one looks so good. If you go into army build and you missed out on the previous one, this is a great one to get. Get a bunch of ones from this. This is a very good time um Bureau guard. It's great. This is this looks so good. This looks like like it's, it's like it's a real Lego. Um, it, it's even better because it's got side print. Jeez, it's really good. Next up, we have uh, Chris Evans's Johnny Storm. Came some fire bits again. The printing is really good on this. Secondary face print as well. This looks so good. The coloring. Of the plastic and the sharpness of the print. Finally we have Blade. Gave him silver moustache, not a uh, beard. Not a fan of that. I, I mean white would have been better than silver. His printing is also a little bit off which is annoying, off-centered. But it's still... Um, also not a fan of the white there. The metallic on the glasses but he is a very good figure still. Only one face though. Hmm. Just seems like a downgrade after the last few. Oh well. Don't know why they gave him this curved blade. Um, to just give him a regular katana. That's... I guess they had spare pieces lying around? Yeah, not 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 good. This is a pretty good set. You get some nice side characters. Some of them are printed very nicely. Some of them not so much, but still good enough. Uh, great army builder for cheap. This is pretty awesome. Yes, there are some problems here, but uh, we are also still gonna be looking at even more bootleg Lego figures of 
Deadpool and Wolverine. That's what happens when a very popular film comes out. So many brands are coming out with all of these figures. And like, wow, like, I'm still waiting for more. Like, I would like some more, like, for example, some Ahsoka related minifigures because more Death Troopers would be nice, for example. And, and you know, figures that the official Lego didn't make. But, you know, they're not making those. They only make some. They made some. But Deadpool Wolverine it seems like everyone is like, oh, let's make more Deadpool Wolverine now because, yeah, it's also doing really well in China. It's doing really well in Hong Kong. And so we've got some nice figures here. And we're going to be getting another bunch. Um, there's going to be like a future cyber pool or something and, and another like monk pool or other pools all the different dead pools from that one scene at the end are getting their own mini figures because the film is doing really well and this one is another one of those good sets um, it's on a full eight figure set it seems like they're slowing down now but this is a great time if you want to get deadpool and wolverine and all of these other figures from the movie Get them now before they run out because, you know, these productions, they're going to end at some point. And I have people on these videos saying like, oh, we're going to buy this. And I look at the videos from like 10, like five or six years ago, even 10 years ago. Jesus Christ. Um, and you're not going to get them anymore because you can't. They're not like official stuff that gets resold and stuff. They probably get in the bin. So if you like these figures now, get them now. And these are really good. So subscribe to just go below because take care. Have a nice day. I'll see you guys soon. Bye bye now.